Hi guys, it's Amanda from the Binky Bunny Shed. So today I'm going to be talking about gerbil bedding. And yesterday I went out and bought two new beddings for the gerbils. Um, currently they're on Megazorb, which I've been using for the past year. Um, I never put my gerbils on wood shavings or sawdust because it tends to um, harm their noses. Because um, my gerbils like to dig quite a lot, I found that um, especially Marvin was getting like a bloody nose and it was really scabby where he'd been like really digging at the wood shavings and sometimes they can be a bit sharp. So um, all four of the gerbils were on Megazorb and um, peeing up my hamster is also on Megazorb and I use it for the rabbit's litter trays as well. So basically what it is, is a virgin wood pulp. And it says it's from Northern Crop Dryers. And it says probably the best bedding on earth. Just there. So this bag um, cost me £7. And I get it from a local country store. Um, I used to get it on off the internet. But then I found a country store that was about half an hour drive away from me. Um, so now I don't have to pay P&P. &P, because um, that's... That the PMP for it costs quite a lot, so I've just got it in this tub here. So this is what it looks like, as you can see. It's really, really soft, and it absorbs um, odors really, really well. It absorbs the pee and the urine really well. So that's that. So yeah, you put that in the tank. Um, I fill their tanks up about, mm, I'd say a third to two thirds of the way. But I've noticed lately, I don't know whether it's the place I'm getting it from, and that it tends to be a tiny bit dusty. So when I was at the country store, I looked around at all the horse beddings, because you can use certain horse beddings for small pets. And I found this, which is cardboard shavings animal bedding. And it's got a picture of a horse, chicken, rat... A rabbit and it looks like a pheasant I think and it says top quality new corrugated cardboard completely biodegradable and it's virtually dust free um, and it's Pierce eco bed and I read up quite a lot on the internet about gerbil beddings and I did find the eco bed on the internet but it was really really expensive because obviously of the postage and packaging again because the bags are so heavy um, so I was really excited when I was in the country store that I found this. Um, and basically what it is, if I open the bag, it's just shredded cardboard. It just looks like that. Um, so it's cardboard just like being cut up into little squares. And it's got no smell to it and there's no dust at all. So what I'm doing now is put in about two thirds of Megazorb in and a third of these cardboard shavings and I put some in last night and I think they really enjoyed it and because they love chewing up cardboard like cardboard tubes and stuff like that so I saw them like um, chewing it all up and taking it into their bed and um, making a nest out of it so this massive bag was £8 and it's really really heavy it's quite big because it's a really wide as well and this will probably last me about a year <laughs> yeah because the bag is so big um yeah but I was really excited when I saw that and um, you can get eco bed and there's also there's one also called um finer card or finner card um I'll put the link um below about it but it's exactly the same thing um, just that that is even more expensive than the eco bed, I think. And it said that it's recommended for gerbils and small animals. So, yeah, um, after this, I'll go upstairs and show you what it looks like in the gerbil tank. Um, and then I, when I was in, uh, I was in Nutcuts, which is like a local garden centre, but it has like a little animal bit. And I saw this. It's the All Pet Softwood Pet pet bedding and I've seen this on the internet as well um, I think it's a lot cheaper on the internet this was 4 99 but I've seen it on the internet for about £1.50 
and this is the fine one and you can get it in fine or coarse I decided to get it in fine and it says it provides an ideal bedding substrate for birds, reptiles and small pets including rabbits, guinea pigs, hamsters, gerbils, rats and day geese um, and it says on the bottom it's 100% natural made from sustainable and treated wood which is really good um, it's virtually dust free, soft underfoot, low maintenance, suppresses odour, free draining, fast drying um, the absorption absorption rate is three to one and it's biodegradable as well which is really good um so yeah i thought i'd give this a go as well and mix this in with the megazorb and the eco bed um, i haven't tried it yet i'm going to put it in the gerbil tanks um on the next clean out that i do um yeah so it looks like pretty good stuff and um, so i thought i'd give that a go um, and also when I was in the country store I saw that you could get a similar thing to this but it's called, um, I think it was called Equisorb and for a massive bower like this size it was £10 so if this is any good then I'd probably get the Equisorb because it's exactly the same thing and um, so yeah I just thought I'd show you the new beddings that I've got so there's Megazorb, Eco Bed and the All Pet Softwood Bedding. So I'm just going to run upstairs now and show you what the cardboard shavings looks like in the gerbil tank. Okay, so this is what the Eco Bed looks like in the gerbil tank. I sprinkled just a bit on top of the Megazorb just because I'm cleaning them out in a couple of days so I didn't want to waste a lot of it. And there's Scruffy. And you like the new eco bed, don't you? <laughs> I've noticed that they've been taking it, um, like putting it in their mouths and putting it in their nest. And they like chewing on it as well. Uh, the only problem that is that it tends to rustle a bit when they're walking on it. But once it's mixed in properly with a the Megazorb, then I think it should be fine. So there we go. And the eco bed is also in the other guy's tank as well. I'll just show you that. So there's Marvin and Pip's tank. Just zoom in. So that's what it looks like. Yeah, so they really enjoy it as well. And what I've done is also is put a tiny bit in Peanut's cage. Just so if he wants to take that up to his bed, he can do that. So there's Peanut. <laughs> Yeah, so there's the new pet bedding that I've got. Uh, once I've cleaned them out, I'll show you what the all pet softwood pet bedding looks like as well. So thanks for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye.